Still and fresh. That's us. Welcome to Boya. Don't want you fellas being late on your first day. Andrew has to think about time. Where are you two from? Ghana. You don't say. Pretty far to travel for an internship. You must be good. Tell us about Andrew. Don't mind Fred. He scares easy. He's the best in the business. Want a tip? Get on his good side. Sooner. Good luck. You need it. What's the newspaper you keep staring at? My statement of intent. You must be the intent. I had meant to mention this earlier. My team, working on the hotel residence house account, needed beefing up. I anticipated that we could reorganize the teams. The new intent have two things to deal with. Reorganizing might not be suitable. Again, in a way, you know, productively and a work in progress in Mexico. The hotel residence calls account needs to. You know, I walked into the brainstorming, picked up a word or two that could be useful to the new account. His newness around here in the scene of Boya might just create an angle as fresh as the sun. Remember that everybody's keen on the teams as they are. You might not like to shake things up until after the pitch day from Mexico. During the brief, I mentioned that the campaign is our goal. Target the motorists and other road users. You asked us to keep it simple. We all work to heighten the simplicity event that makes the product accessible. It allows, as you can see from the initial concept, that a greater part of our young professionals will add more value to the really targeted market. From the posters I have been looking at, it appears you do not incorporate those of the second economy. Young people who own businesses and who from time to time need to have a good time. Simplicity works for all. Everyone can relate to it in a way that does not seem forced to him or her. With the marriage of adverts and outdoor materials the consumers come in contact with daily. We as a team believe that this allows the consumer to be more comfortable with our product. Let us execute what I've just heard. I'm coming up against a brick wall. I drive a BMW. Hmm. I thought we were making love with our minds. Patience, baby. This is only for play. What about our targets? I mean, demographic targets. Friends, right. As a woman, I feel it's important we appeal to all demographics. We can't still afford to alienate a male market. What are you saying, Frey? Women don't drive Maxon? Ouch. No, no, that is not what I meant. Our job is to look at the bigger picture. Yes. Andrew spoke about bending people's perspectives. And that's exactly what we're going to do. So tell us, how are you going to bend people's perspectives? As easy as fresh milk, my friend. Here is the key word for my idea. Generational. Hey, don't have a number in case we need to business. Mm. 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 So how are we going to present this thing to the big week? I'll speak first. I think Phil should speak last. <laughs> I like it. Start with a whimper and end with a bang. Shut up, Tom!
Tom, you speak Sego. Tell her you go third. Fred opens with the facts. Your statement of intent. You know I'm good at those. <laughs> Tell her. You give him an introduction to the concept. Tell him a big idea, but not too much. We have to keep him begging for more. Tom, maybe do something humorous. <laughs> <laughs> it's important that Andrew is constantly surprised. As for myself, I'll deliver the soccer punch. This is ours for the ticket. That sounds good. I think we all deserve a drink. Don't you think so, Fred? Yes, I agree, Tom. <laughs> <laughs>